Roll the video, guys, and welcome to the stage. Too. That song that we just did was a song by Love 
called Love Runs Out by One Republic. Hope you liked it. So we have internally here, we have a lot of different celebrities. I call Joe Levitt one. I'd say that we have people like Chris Hogan with a deep voice coming up front. We have new guys like Chris Brown, ridiculously good looking up front. But you know what? We have other celebrities internally. If you are listening to the Lampo forums, you see those. You know there's people who have little witty posts, people who post too much. We think those people are celebrities as well. We had a very unique opportunity that one of those local celebrities actually approached us. So we wanted to show this video for you guys. Hi, I'm Will Hendrian, and I'm here to tell you about our homemade artisan bread. As seen on the Lambo forums, it's made with premium, unbleached, unbromated flour and consists of only four simple ingredients. And folks, this is the official bread of sharing the profits. If you want to have some bread endorsed by these rock stars, come to my desk in the church department. Buy this bread. It's breader than you deserve. <laughs>
Who should I vote for? Hmm, there's that one band. Yeah. <laughs> Sharing the profits. Share and the profits? That's a no brainer. <laughs> Thank you, Mark, for your awesome leadership. That was a song by Radioactive. If you didn't hear that word enough in that song, it's by uh, Imagine Dragons. So we have, we wanted to take a moment to thank a couple people who made this possible. First of all, our awesome AV team. They were here crazy late. Woo! They were here late last night making sure that we could hear. And it's awesome. They're so great. We wanted to thank John Melton for making us that intro video. He's awesome. And he wasn't busy enough, so we had to add something to his play. The other thing is Micah Smith made that poster. And the fun thing about, if you don't know Micah Smith, because he's kind of holds to himself, but he's actually crazy famous in like the poster making world. You can Google Michael, Micah Smith posters and you'll see posters he's made for like Foo Fighters or uh, Maroon 5 and all kinds of different people and he was so excited to add Share of the Prophets to that list. So. <laughs> we also wanted to thank our family, uh, some of our families over there, my little son's here to hear daddy rock out. But how many country music fans do we have here? Yeah? We had a feeling. See, we live here in Nashville, and you know what? When you talk about Battle of the Bands, you think this is kind of a rock, rock show. We get to have Jimmy, people like that, just rock out. But we realized that our band was consisted of, well, we have a fiddle player who's wearing cowboy boots and lives on a farm. There you go. <laughs> we have Brian Bush, who actually toured professionally as a banjo player. And a lot of people don't know that. And so we were like, you know what? For our last song, Let's just throw it off and let's do a country song. This is a little Keith Urban for you guys. Oh, 
And for those keeping score at home, that's six team members, zero spouses. Seven. Dang it, I can't count. All right. Uh, well, hey, you know, uh, we, have, we have another, uh, another like, real contest, not just, just fun to play at home, uh, a poster design contest. The guys kind of talked about uh, Micah. So what I'm going to ask uh, real quick is, is all the designers uh, that, uh, that produced one of those to just kind of come up here to the front of the stage for me. Uh, they, they love attention uh, and love uh, public speaking. Um, and so just wanted to, uh, to introduce each of these folks who, who kind of shared their, uh, their talents there. Uh, what, what, and I, I don't really know any of them, except Brad, I know you, Ben. Hey, good to see you. Um, but these are all team members, no spouses here. Um, but uh, but what, say your name, if you don't mind. And Charlie Gann. Good, good job. And uh, which, which poster did you design? Uh, uh, it was uh, the cracker one. Definitely the cracker. 